said, Peter, calm down. You ain't got to figure it all out. I didn't bring you up here to work and toil your way through this. I came up here to show you something. This is my son. It is as simple as this. Listen to him. And so many of us get caught up in working for God that we forget that God is working for us. He's on our behalf. He knows what we need to do. Listen to I promise you, he knows his plans that he's got for your life, and he'll make them known to you. You ain't got to work and toil to make it. Because we get caught in that, and all of a sudden we burn out because we're spinning our wheels. Busyness does not mean you're taking care of business. And so many of us get busy trying to do for God that we never come into a place where we do with God. And that's all God is saying. He's like, he shut down. The cloud came on their life. Shut up, Peter. Just listen to him. He wants a tabernacle. He'll tell you to build one. I promise you. He'll let you know. Just listen to him. And he does the same with us. Tell me he don't. Who put a cloud on our life and shut the world down around us. Everything stops. And all he's trying to do is get us back to the simplicity. Just listen to him. You don't got to figure it all out. Just listen to him. He'll make known to you. He'll explain it to you. Get in his word. Get before his presence. Hit your knees. Let your face hit the ground. He'll let you know. Listen to him. Have ears to hear. Have eyes to see. Have a heart to receive. Just listen to him. So as we go forward, that's all we're doing. I can't make the suddenlies happen. But I can dare walk with him, listening to his commands, and witness the suddenlies when they show up. Because I promise you, <laughs> this is not the end of God's journey with us. He's got so much that we've never contemplated, ready to pop off in our lives. And you know you want to see God do that in yours. This is how it happens. Like this is as simple as it is. Just commit to walking with him. And when he shows up suddenly, ah, just praise him. And be in it. Guys, I wanted to put it down because I want you to see a God who is still living, who is still active. I wanted to make it known. And trust me, I know. I ain't got to get the, the email. I know it crazy. So is my God. He is good. He ain't safe. He didn't call us to the possible. If I could do this, why would I need God? You know what I'm saying? And you want the impossible in life. Otherwise, you'd already be done because you could do it. And I'm trying to show you something here that God is ready and willing to work the impossible. Start with the small things he calls you to do. <laughs> be faithful and few, and he'll bring the big things. He'll bring the suddenlies as you dare follow. All I'm asking, all I'm encouraging, all I'm saying is just trust and obey. He's got so many suddenlies ready to pop off in your life. He got so much for you. You are going to be in awe of him because he is still an awe-inspiring God.